Hello, MJ Fishers here. This is another batch file video. And this one is going to be on how to uh, make a message box appear. So first you want to open up Notepad and type in at echo off. So hit enter, next line, you want to type in echo. X equals msg for message and then box. And then you want to do a space, then parenthesis, quote, and then I kind of forget, I think this is the title. So I'll just type in title, and you type in another quote, and the comma. And this is like the symbol that pops up. I think 16 is an exclamation point, then another quote, and I think that's the body. And then do another parenthesis. Then type greater than sign. And then what you want to call it. And where are you going to put it? Just do C slash users slash Matthew slash desktop. And then I'll call it. Oh. Oh, yeah. Because you'll have to um, have this saved somewhere. And let's just call it. message box and then you have to do dot vbs and then start copy this put it right here and there we go so I'll just save it as message box dot bat I guess save and there we go whoops I guess it's opposite. So this is the body. And this is the title. Save it again. And there we go. And something really funny you can do with this is you can do top. You go to top. Save. Now, if you watch my last video. You can do a timer, and I don't know, let me show you something with a timer that you can do that's really cool. Um, I'm just going to pause the video until I get it done. Okay, and the timer part of it is done. So the part I taught you was this right there, and that. So what I did is just make it so that you can type in how many times you want it to go, and next year. And something that's really funny to do is if you put it on one, then you type in like 20. It just goes like that. Which, which is really a pain to get out of. And what would happen if I typed in like 50 or something? So yeah, MJ Fisher's here, and thank you for watching.